My new one just came out, Black McCool. It is the standalone sequel to Atlantic City Nights. It's a crime novel set in modern day about uh, different mobs kind of coming together, going to war sometimes, but it, it's an interesting story. Check it out. The first novel was set in the 1970s and 80s, and it depicted the uh, Atlantic City casinos when they first came about, and how they were funded by some of the, the boys in this sense, and uh, a lot of craziness happened then. So this new story kind of talks about the aftermath of what happened in present day, and it follows a new character with a new story, how he's kind of going against the old regime. Pretty cool. It's, it talks about a, um, an online gambling venture, a new age crime. Everybody's trying to get a piece of it. So I'm inspired by uh, you know learning about the history and, and the fact that this, this is some true stuff that I talk about, um, and just doing my research, talking to the right to the right people, and of course growing up in the area, it's just, it's fascinating. We're so, we're so close to uh, just some some pretty interesting history here. I always loved writing, but I never imagined really putting out four books at this point. I mean, doing the first one was, was cool enough, but you know, the fact that I have four out is uh, it's pretty exciting, so hopefully more to come. I think the biggest inspiration comes from my friends and the support of everybody who really exposes me and, 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 and talks about my, uh, my books and, and, and it spreads the word. That's all I can ask, just spread the word. And tell a friend, tell a family member, tell a spouse. That's the best thing I could ask for. You can find them on Amazon.com. You can go to my website, booksbymccusker.com, or you can come here every Saturday to bring a team to Farmer's Market on 15th and Revere. And I'm here 8 to 12 every Saturday until Labor Day. Just keep at it. it it's it, it's a tough, um, tough thing sometimes to sit down and write a book, but if it really inspires you and that's what you want to do, just keep chasing your passion. I, I mean, I, I know I'm not quite done. I'm still chasing it. So, if anyone's out there and, and, and any young ins inspired writers, all I can say is just just keep penning away and never give up. That's the biggest thing. Never give up. It's all about following your dream and just living life. I mean, we're here on a beautiful day here in Brigantine. It's some great people. I mean, what more can you ask for? Just live your life.